Welcome back to a new episode of Take It. It works perfectly. Too perfect. I've actually seen the thing jamming up because there's too many mobs. Anyway, as you can see, there's no signs there. I'll get to that back to that in a second. Yeah. Now, I kind of noticed this the other day. <clears throat> Sorry, I've got a bit of a sore throat. Uh, yeah. This fills up the full. This takes forever to empty. I didn't think that, but this just takes too much time. Wait, did I? I don't know if I actually showed that. Yeah, overclocking everything. Well, I've overclocked stuff. Okay. I can't remember if I actually did show you that. Yeah, usual of none. Yeah, so I wanted to upgrade the power system for that. And I thought I could go build an ultimate solar panel or solar array or I think it's yeah, soldier is on this. I could have built that, but then that's kind of boring. Let's build a nuclear reactor. That's the next thing. Ooh, I forgot about that as well. Hmm. Okay, yeah. So I thought, let's go build a nuclear reactor for it. So I've set up everything out there. Just, I can't remember what I've done with my uranium. Nope, oh, nothing there. Oh, there it is. Need to, okay, I need to turn this stuff into bars, which I can't believe I actually haven't done that with any of that there. Now, I'm quite sure I can press this. Yep, the machine's working. Just to confirm, make sure we've got a bar coming out of it. Yeah. Okay, we'll leave that to do its job. And we'll get started. Now, this thing needs coolant cells. A lot of them. Yeah, a lot. Now, I was going to do this first because, well, coolant cells are quite irritating to make. Because I need to fill all these up, put them all into an extractor, and consider they don't uh, stack, it makes it even worse. Okay, so I just thought maybe skip that bit. Yeah, not really a point. Do I actually have anything in here? Yes, I do. Rubber. I was making more whilst I was uh, creating all this stuff. Okay, so I'll put the rubber away and we'll continue building because, hey, there's still a lot to do. Now, I thought of a Mark 1 setup, which. I'll get to a bit more into that later on, but uh, for just now, I don't think I can build anything else. I can build the uranium cells. I need more cells for that. Okay, that was annoying. Actually, I can't because I don't have the, I don't have the ore. Is this thing compressed enough? 25, only need 8. Well, in this case, 16 because there's only 16 spaces in it. Well, capsules. Oh, are you kidding me? These don't stack either. Okay, I'll just keep them in there. Ah, uh, great. Okay, can't make them because I'm still waiting for the coolant cells. Oh, can make the reactor plane. Yeah, simple little, little recipe. Why? Uh, nothing wants the stack. Okay, for the reactor chamber, we will need eight. So that's, yeah, eight sets. I'll just fill this one as well. Please say they stack. Uh, 
first one might be my eight sets. Two, three, no, that's just seven. One more to go. Okay. Advanced circuits. I know I know these stack. And I believe it's two in the reactor. Yeah. Oh, don't have a generator. I want to build one. I might do that in a second. Okay, now is it the heat dispensers that needed these? Yeah, advanced circuits plus heat. So let's make more. I'll fill just the top row. Put the rest back in here. Ah, oh, can't believe that stuff doesn't stack. Let's see how our coolant cells are doing. Whoops. Oh, we're getting a lot of these. Okay, let's build what we need to build. Coolant cells got, got heat dispensers. They don't even start. Uh, okay. Since none of this stuff wants to stack, and I can see why it doesn't want to stack now, but thank you, rain. It's just gotten windy. Okay, now that it's stopped raining, I've come to the conclusion of I know that I'm gonna do. I'm gonna build the reactor first, set it up, then put all this, build the rest of my stuff that I need to. Uh, okay, so the chambers, each one of them. So I'm going to need at least eight of them. Heat dispensers. Two, four, six. One more. Okay, chamber. And one more chamber. So it's got eight chambers. I put the plate in back in here because I don't actually know. Well, I don't know now what I need it for, but just store it in there. Oh, the reactor. Now I need two in this. Yeah, and a generator which I still forget to build. Forgot to build. Battery and generator. Okay, so I just uh, went and built the furnace there because, well, I take it you already know how to make one of them. Generator. Is, uh, no, right, furnace. That and I sort of had to sneeze a quite a bit. Got a bad habit that I can't sneeze just once, it's impossible. Ooh, I'll need my wrench to remove my solar panel. Just not in that, it'll be in this. Now, the reactor setup, I'm not 100% too sure, but I have found of a way to build it. I want to make it a Mark 1, which means the Mark 1 is it doesn't build up heat, so it's like permanently safe. The reason why I'm directly connecting this is because max output is 248 I believe this runs maximum of 248 yeah, the reactor is designed to power this 
Oh, six chambers. Yeah, Mark one. Well, Mark one without cooling, I believe. Yeah, so I just fill it up and on we'll go. Okay, my uh, coolant cells will be the side. That's a lot of cells. No, I'll put the cells in just now. I may as well. Hmm. Now, all I really know is one line, or two lines, which I believe is the center two. That's about it. Okay, I'm gonna take a pause, set it up, and well, set just the coolants up because I need to have a look back to the set up photo that I have. Okay, so I've got the coolant set up. Now to build the rest of it. And then turn it on. Dispenser. I'm going to need more plain. Still need three more. I think I made too many of these. Three. Okay, now to put them into the reactor because this is how it gets built. Uh, I probably won't need to take a skip for this because it's. I know the positions of them. There we go. Now it's just to put uranium, uranium into it and it should power this. Okay, I'm going to make a backup to the world because I sorry I don't trust nuclear reactors too much. Back in a second. Okay, I'm meant to put the uranium in. And hopefully it doesn't explode. Better mess that best making a lever then as well because that's how you turn them on and off. No, I'm gonna take this stuff out. Put in here because I forgot I updated the sorting system, so it now sorts this stuff. Wood. Oh, okay. Already had it on us. Okay, now for my. Yeah, eight. I need. Please don't immediately explode. Should have put the lever down first. Seems fine. Whoa, now we're getting power. You know what? Let's put this down here as well. 
Okay, that's just eating the scrap up. Yeah, it can't cope. Ooh, that's what we wanted. Now all we really need to do is make sure this thing stays like this and stays topped up. Okay, now that we've done that, well, let's just make a little upgrade here around here because I now have two more dark armor. Hmm. <clears throat> now, what should I? Yeah, these two seem fine. I forgot to pick up creepies again. How do I? Okay, close them. Do I have close them? Yeah, I do. Just, just put through the sorting system and all that. That should be enough. Yeah, why not? There we go. Two new energy collectors. Definitely working. Run up quicker. And yeah, it seems to be fine. Nothing's majorly dropping, which is a good sign. You're still full power. You're destroying everything. You're out of power. Okay, it must be night time then. Mm hmm. Now, just I think it's just getting a power solution for this, and I'm not cooking up to this. Might actually. Hmm. Anyway, guys, I think that'll be all for today's episode. I know it's another short one, but I'm finding it harder to make these. Well, actually, some more to do. Knock this off the board. Make a nuclear reactor. Today. There we go. And craft a mass fabricator because I've already done that. Hmm. <clears throat> I think next episode I might build a house. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye.